time and time again, Rita Apodaca says she and her fellow neighbors on Malpais have been left to pick up the mess. It's just frustrating that we have to deal with this and nobody's helping us. She estimates at least four times over the last 12 years, someone has gone too fast around this curve by his lead in cores in southwest Albuquerque. They've smashed into her fence, leaving it, well, looking like this. A mangled and twisted mess. You can still see the tire tread marks left behind from yesterday when neighbors say a car went off the road here and collided into that fence. It's just one of a long list of problems they've seen here. Apodaca admits she's tired of dealing with this year in and year out. A speed bump was put in, and so were signs warning drivers of the curve. But Apodaca says it hasn't done much to slow people down and stop the crashes. We have to come out here at 10 o'clock at night and have our fences come down. You know, and have drunk people in the middle of our yard and our mailbox in the middle of the street. She emailed County Commissioner R. De La Cruz's office asking for help last year. Now she's turning to Action 7 News for help. I'm hopeful now that I've called you guys and I've been dealing with this that something will resolve it. And to mend this broken fence once and for all. Reporting in Southwest Albuquerque, Mike Springer, KOAT Action 7 News.